Now we are going to meditate. In the more advanced level, to meditate is to take a rest. To take a rest in this moment as it is. Especially because anything that happened in this moment is the dancing of the same perfection, the smile of the same Buddha, if you like. Not Taraj, the dancing of the Shiva. What the mind call as wrong, right, false, true, bad, good, they are all the dancings of the same perfection. What the emotion call as sad, glad, sorrow, joy, they are all the dancings of the same perfection. For that reason, always keep in the heart, rest your mind in this moment as it is. That is the innermost core of meditation. To make the idea more practical, rest the mind on the gap between two breaths, between in-breath and out-breath, there is a gap, between out-breath and in-breath, there is a gap, less than one second, no need to stop the breath, no need to shorten the breath, breath as natural as possible, simply feel the gap between two breaths. That is the practical way of resting the mind in this moment as it is. Some of you who learn quantum physics understand. In the moment when you feel the gap between two breaths, the gap between two sounds, the gap between two memory, you enter quantum field in which many things impossible can become possible include the impossible disease to be healed can be healed if you feel the gap between two breaths very very often rest the mind by feeling the gap between two breaths As the natural nature of water which is wet, the natural nature of the mind keep jumping to the past and the future, 
keep responding to sound and memory. That is the natural nature of the mind. No need to entertain the mind by thinking, analyzing, comparing. No need, no need. Simply realize the true nature of the mind is jumping. But without any guilty feeling, without blaming your mind, softly be Bring your concentration to the gap between two breaths. That is the innermost core of meditation. No need to respond to the mind. No need to entertain the mind by analyzing, thinking, comparing. No need. Without any guilty feeling, softly bring the mind to the gap between two breaths. That is the innermost core of meditation. Anything can happen outside, but do not let the things that happen outside steal your own inner peacefulness. How? Rest the mind on the gap between two breaths. Here in Ashram Avalokiteshwara, we hear the voice of motorcycle. Use any voice in your place as holy bell to return to the gap between two breaths. The voice of singing birds, the voice of karaoke from your neighbor, the voice of car alarm, any voice. Use it as holy bell to return back to the gap between two breaths. Remember the beautiful mantra that I keep sharing to you. Acknowledge the wave. Stay with the ocean. No matter how deep you meditate, there is always wave inside. Even in the stage of enlightenment, Gamma wave of the brain, there is still wave in the brain. However, you are no longer the wave, you are now the ocean. Feel the gap between two breaths. Remember, beautiful soul, meditation heals you not by changing yourself. Meditation heals you by accepting yourself as you are. Feel the gap between two breaths.
quoting from one of holy scripture from the roof of earth tibet dry season does not reduce the amount of water in universe raining season does not increase the amount of water in the universe in the same way sad glad bad good sorrow joy pain pleasure they do not decrease they do not increase anything simply take rest on the gap between two breaths that is the innermost core of meditation no need to blame the jumping mind no need to blame the bad memory and bad mood no need simply softly bring the mind to the gap between two breath in the old book of meditation has been written fear happen because mind keep living in the future anxiety stress depression happen because mind live in the past as soon as the mind live totally in the present by resting the mind in this moment as it is you do not only heal the fear about future you do not only heal the anxiety stress and depression but you also open the gate of healing and peace simply by resting your mind in this moment as it is feel the gap between two breath I never tired to share to all of you the three golden steps into inner heaven the three golden steps into inner nirvana that is accept flow and smile in the moment you accept by saying yes you will experience less tension and also experience more peace accept that is the first step into the inner heaven the inner nirvana whatever the blessing of this moment from numbness until peace of mind simply accept as it is the second step flow as water in the river can pass all obstacle because of keep flowing you also can pass all obstacles of life by keep flowing the third steps to the inner nirvana the inner peace inner heaven smile smile is a strong sign that you are no longer a victim you are now a master
for that reason mind can jump into 1000 direction always accept flow smile then feel the gap between two breath The other explanations about meditation Meditation is the art of making the mind being innocent as innocent as the mind of the children Simply by accepting this moment as it is free from judgment that is the innocent mind Feel the gap between two breaths. The most important reason why many people deeply suffer because they keep entertaining the mind. What I mean by entertaining the mind, responding to the mind, getting angry when the mind is dissatisfied, enjoying the joy when the mind is satisfied. comparing competing analyzing that is another kind of entertaining the mind now stop entertaining the mind rest the mind in this moment as it is without comparing without competing without analyzing simply rest in this moment as it is Remember to fill the gap between two breath Keep in the heart beautiful soul among 7 billion people on earth there is only one who can heal you completely and holistically and that person is you when you come to medical doctor psychologist or even spiritual master maybe you can talk to him or her only one hour but you talk to yourself 24 hours a day from childhood until old age meaning you are the best healer to yourself how to become the best healer to yourself rest the mind on the gap between two breath You will stop all the energy draining that come out from critical and negative mind. As soon as all energy draining stop from coming out from negative mind, the body will have enough energy to heal at to heal itself. That is what I mean by being the best healer to yourself.
like universe keep flowing from night into day day into night the same thing happen with the mind keep flowing sad glad sorrow joy blame praise sad happy but remember you are no longer those wave you are now a surfer and the bed excuse me and you are no longer the wave you are now a surfer and the board of the surfer is beautiful smile simply smile to any wave of the mind simply smile take a distance to any wave whether you like it or you dislike it never forget to rest the mind on the gap between two breath The longer you rest the mind on the gap between two breath the closer you are to the mind which is as wide as the space imagine your mind is now as wide as the space which providing space to anything and anyone without choosing without picking that is the kind of the mind that heal you that is the kind of the mind that will open the gate of happiness and peace another analogy anything that the mind like or dislike is like clouds dark clouds and white clouds simply let the clouds coming and going it does not matter white cloud or dark cloud simply let them coming and going now you are no longer the clouds you are the blue sky the witnessing blue sky that is how meditation heal The great musician Mozart said once upon a time The most beautiful music is the gap between two sound Mozart is 100% correct because in the gap between two sound in the gap between two breath you enter quantum field in weeks there are many thing impossible can become possible after resting the mind long enough especially because without forgiving soul will never grow and glow without forgiving soul will never grow and glow First of all, visualize a crying baby on your left hand. It is the symbol of your soul wound, bad memories of the past. It can be harmed by immature parents. 
it can be bullied in the school time it can be being left behind by your boy or girl friends any bad memory and bad experience from the past symbolizes a crying baby on your left hand and the meditative approach of forgiving yourself is give the crying baby space without any resistance without any refusal simply give space that is the meditative approach to forgive yourself as material of contemplation even the holy souls committed mistakes in the beginning in the process of being more mature for that reason now forgive your dark past forgive by giving space to the crying baby on your left hand After forgiving yourself, now learn to forgive someone who harmed you in the past. It can be a mature parent, it can be ex-boyfriend, girlfriend who left you behind, anyone who harmed you in the past. Visualize them as crying baby on your right hand. in order to make the rose of forgiving beautifully bloom within please deeply contemplate it was not violence it was not violence which make the others harm you it was not violence it was suffering it is not only you suffer but the people who make you suffer also suffer even worse sadly they try to heal themselves by attacking the others as a result they do not get the medicine they eat another most another more dangerous poison that is how to forgive the enemies now visualize the crying baby on your left hand your soul wound giving rose of forgiving to the crying baby on your right hand the suffering of enemy at the same time always remember the beautiful message of the late nelson mandela without forgiving you will bring portable prison wherever you go without forgiving you will bring portable prison wherever you go to make your soul journey perfect now recall the white light of father from the sky entering your crown chakra and rest in the fourth chakra of the heart recall the red light of mother from earth entering the first chakra also resting in the heart both the white light of father from the sky and red light of mother from earth embrace each others giving birth to the ping of love to make the ping of love clear 
to you. Now memorize the thing that make you feel grateful. Like healthy body, happy family, happy children, blooming flower, singing birds, many things that make you feel deeply grateful. That is the outer manifestation of pure love. Make the ping of light of love wider and wider, circling the whole of your body, giving the light into every single cell of your body, especially the part of your body which is painful. Now share the pink light of love to the one who you love. It can be your husband, wife, children, parent, close friend. By imagining their kind deeds. Imagine the kind deeds of the loved one. That is the way to send them a beautiful spirit of love. Now send the light of love to the enemies, to the people who make you suffer in the past. They are also kind because make you much more wise and mature. To make your love unlimited and unconditional, now share the pink light of love to lower, middle, and upper realms. From hell, Satan, Gumatat Gumitit, animal, virus, include coronavirus, plant, mamadi, human beings, demigods, gods, all mother sentient being in samsaric realm, lower middle upper realm, realm of dharma protector, mother kiva father tangan, dragon garuda lion tiger, realm of arahat, realm of bodhisattva. Now together we are sending all of them the pink light of love. Those who suffer with illness, disease, pain, any kind of suffering, may they are healed by this kind of light of love. To those who suffer because of hunger, may they enjoy delicious food. To those who suffer because thirsty, may get, they get sufficient drink. To those who suffer because of homeless, may they have a beautiful home. To those who asking for blessing, may all of them get countless blessing. To those who want to attain peace and enlightenment, may all of them enjoy peace and enlightenment. Now, as soon as you open your eyes, whisper deep into your, se your soul the beautiful mantra of Aham Prema, meaning, 
I am love who is here to share love. Aham prema, aham prema, aham prema. Do you thank you, beautiful friend?